How's it going, YouTube? It's your boy, Ron. Welcome to our final episode of Let's Play Pokemon Emerald. In our last episode, we entered the Pokemon League. We successfully defeated all four of the Elite Four members. And of course, in our final episode, our task is to, of course, take on the champion to see who gets the right to be called Champion Opponent. It's been a long journey. We've had a lot of difficulties. There's been a lot of battles, a lot of uncertainty, a lot of challenges, but a lot of positivity. But of course, this has led up to the final battle. This will be the last battle we do, and it's against the champion. This is where it all ends. Everyone's ready, everyone's healed up, everyone's good to go. Slightly lower level than the champion's folks, but that's okay. I know we can handle it. Let's go ahead and commence onto the final battle. And a familiar face it is. From Wallace. Ah, welcome, Ron boy. That incident in Sutopla City. That was superb work putting an end to the crisis all by yourself. Oops, it didn't mean to be. It didn't. It wouldn't be fair to say that you alone ended the crisis. You overcame the difficult situation by working as one with your Pokemon. We trainers raise Pokemon by giving them items and by teaching them new techniques for battle. By but we ourselves learn also learn many things from Pokemon. And this is where your achievements are put to the test against what others like you have achieved. Now, who can most elegantly dance with their Pokemon in Hoenn? Show me right here, right now. It is against our final battle, last battle we have to do, against our former friend, or our friend, Wallace. Let's begin. Champion Wallace, the lights of battle. For, well, in Ruby and Sapphire, he would have been a gym leader, and, but that's not the case. As Juan took over, he has now become reigning champion. And of course, he starts off with a level 57 Weight Lord. Uh, what I want to do, since I know a lot of water types typically will be using special moves, I'm going to go ahead with the light screen. Hopefully, I can survive that. Alright, good. Still did a lot. That did. That did a little bit more than half. Gotta risk it. Alright, now I gotta heal. I gotta heal. So far, not a great start, but I like the battle music. Very uplifting and very suiting for a final battle. That did more. What? That did more. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna go for. I'm just gonna go for Thunderbolt. Yeah, I had a feeling. Thunder would have knocked it out. I think Water Sprout does its damage based, Water Spout does its damage based on HP. It'll heal. It's gonna heal. Alright. Please don't miss again, Rogue. Please. This this battle depends on you not missing. Oh my god. Do I have a full revive? Or did I use it? Okay. Oh, revival bird. Alright, I gotta risk it. Now we do it. <sighs> At least that should not get out. Okay, that I okay, everything that happened from the start is made up for based on that moment. That made up for it. Gyarados is next. Okay, I should outspeed Gyarados. I should outspeed Gyarados. That should one hit it easy. I don't care about the intimidate, I'm not using a physical move. That's one hitting it. There's no way it lives that. There's no way. It's times four. Come on. This game is gonna be broken if it lives that. Alright. This game would have been seriously broken if it lived that. I would have been so pissed. Wish Cash. Alright, perfect poke. We've seen a Wish Cash already at one, and of course the perfect adversary is Fruity Who else but him?
really don't think Giga Drain's gonna one hit it though. It's probably gonna leave it at a little under half, like maybe 70% damage. Yeah, roughly 60-ish damage. Yes, throws that special defense stat pretty high. Alright, if that's the case, I'm gonna go with Sludge Bomb. Oh, it's because it's a ground type. Wow, that crit. It's probably gonna heal. Yeah. Well, that special defense raising up is gonna take all, pretty much all my Giga Drains at this point. But at least I'll get some of my HP back. Sky Overcut? Yeah, there was no way it was gonna do twice the kill a poke. I doubt it. That would've been super rare if it did that. Alright, unnecessary crit. Would've liked that a little bit earlier, but that's okay. Signature poke. Uh, Road is really the only one that can take advantage of it, uh, but he's taking a lot of damage. I'm gonna heal up Road and I'll just sacrifice Fruit of the Loom. Sheesh. Uh, heal it. Heal it. Yeah, Ice Beam's gonna knock it out 100%. Thank you for the room. Your, your bravery will not be forgotten. Light Screen definitely has special attacks. Definitely want to beef it up. My low tick is a special wall, so that's not a shock. Pretty sure my low tick also has citrus berries, so if I can get a paralysis or a crit, that would help a lot. It's gonna citrus berry it, isn't it? Oh, it has recover. Oh man, I'm gonna run out of PP for this, aren't I? Poison might take me out first, though. garbage. Alright, Kip. Need you to do your work. Need you to do your work. Please, 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 please. Now it's just very activates. Alright. Earthquake. It's gonna do neutral damage. Shouldn't do too much. Are you fucking kidding me? Come on, can I get a crit? Like an actual, not like an unnecessary crit. I'm tired of getting those. Can I get a crit?
not gonna lie, I thought it would be, I thought it would have used recover. But it's okay. I <laughs> I almost played myself, but that worked out perfectly fine. Ludicolo. Uh. Uh. I'll save Link. I'm gonna use Kurama just because of the part grass type. It's only gonna do neutral damage, but it's better than nothing. Just have to get rid of two more pokes. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Gotta confuse it. Gotta get lucky. I gotta get lucky. Good start, good start. Alright, neutral damage time. I would have, I would rather it attack me than do that. If I can get a burn or a crit. Okay, burn. Hit yourself. Oh, it's trying to. S okay. It probably has full restore again, so it's probably gonna. Wait, no. It has too high H. Wait, no. The burn. Ooh, that might have screwed me over. Oh, never mind. Okay, good. Good. Oh, ho, ho. Kurama with the plays ignored the double team. Ignored it completely. That's what's up. Let's go. And last is Tentacruel. Alright, perfect. This should be my victory. Oink can take this. Easy. Well, should be easy. Oh, but that's gonna hurt. Oh. Uh, Oh, I thought it was going to do a lot more. Please tell me that was a low roll. Come on, come on, boy, you can eat this easy. Player defeated. The champion Wallace. The champion has been defeated. As I, the champion, fall in defeat. That was a wonderful work. You were elegant and furiously so. And yet, it was utterly glorious. Kudos to you, Rob Boy. You are a truly noble Pokemon trainer. Let me get some money. The Pokemon you sent into battle, at times they danced like a spring breeze, and at times they struck like lightning. It was with light, yet sure-footed elegance that you led your Pokemon. Even I felt bedazzled by your masterful performance. You now stand at the glorious peak of the Pokemon League. I now proclaim you to be the new Hoenn region. What? Me? Hey, what the hell are you doing here? Here's some, here's some advice before you challenge the champion. Huh? What, 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 what? Could it be that it's already over? Yeah, no. See? What did I tell you, man? Didn't I tell you that you don't need to worry about Ron Boy? You've finally done it. When I heard that you defeated your own father at the Pedal Brick Gym, I thought perhaps you got a chance. But to think you actually become the champion? Ah, uh, yes. What has become of your Pokédex? Here, let me see. You've seen a hundred- I've seen 151! Crazy! And I've only got 24. Some Pokémon only appear in certain areas. You must be persistent. Anyways, congratulations. Now go proudly into the final room. No. Let me rephrase that properly. A new champion. Come with me. Man, what the hell now you can't come in? What, did you beat did you beat Wallace? You dumb it? No. From here only the trainers who have become champions may enter. You have to wait outside with Professor Burr. I'm just joking, that's okay, that's the rule. Honestly, congratulations. And of course, with every defeat of the champion, you of course gain access to the final room, the chamber. This room, this is where it keeps records of Pokemon that prevailed through the harsh battles. It is here that the league champions are on. Come on, let's record your name as a trainer who triumphed over the Pokemon League and the names of the partners who battled with you. And of course, I gotta give a big shout out to all six of them. They've all prevailed and done me so well throughout the course of the journey. Couldn't have done without them. They were all stars.
my boy Road. And Kurama. Of course, shout out to my boy David. And C Money. Of course, shout out to my boy Christian. Of course. And my boy Oink. With the psychic power. Let's go. Fruit of the Loom. Massive strength. And of course, the main starter of it all, Kip. The Swamper. Where it all began for me. Welcome to the Hall of Fame. All six of these folks have done excellent for me. I do want to give a minor shout out to Swabu Tweet. Didn't cut it, but of course did do well, very well up until around the fifth gym leader. And as the league champion, congratulations. Our journey through the Hoenn region has successfully brought us the pinnacle of the Hoenn region, being the champion. That concludes our journey. And of course it is fitting that we're just given the credits. Very peaceful and calming credits too. But that ends our Generation 3 journey. So of course we have dabbled in Generation 2. Of course my first Let's Play being Pokemon Stadium 2. We all knew what that was about. And Generation 3. Of course this is going to be the handheld series. That's what this was about. Unlike the spin-off series as Pokemon Stadium 2 was. And of course I still plan on doing a lot more um, Let's Plays of Pokemon in the near future. With one... With... Can't even say that. With one... Um, Let's Play coming to an end. There is of course a new one along the horizon. It'll be coming up in the coming days. I have thought about a couple ones. I don't know which one I'm going to start off first, but of course when that time comes you guys will certainly know which one it is. It's just been of course like the previous ones. It has been fun and amazing to be doing this and of course thank massive, massive thank you to everyone who is a part of the journey with me. It's of course in part of your support and admiration that it, this is all possible. Just love doing it, and of course, for, from you guys, it is a massive thanks and massive love from all of you who are able to support me in doing this. It's fun doing it, especially in the Mario Pokemon series game, everything, it's my favorite, and that's what I plan on doing, of course, in the next Let's Play. Um, like I said, haven't decided which one I'm going to do, I do have many in mind, um, but I kind of want to spread it out in terms of variety to a certain degree. And I'm still kind of thinking which ones I can do, but... Um, I'll let that be for um, for next time when I decide that. Uh, I guess we can kind of just enjoy the credits for Pokemon Emerald. If you know, it's just gonna be our character just cycling along. We see Pokemon pretty much. That's that's pretty much it. But that does conclude our Pokemon Emerald uh, Let's Play. This has been the third Let's Play. So of course, it all started with Pokemon Stadium 2. It followed up with Pikmin. Led us up to Pokemon Emerald. Uh, haven't decided which one I'll do though. I'll decide on that. Next, I'll decide on that. Uh, uh, in terms of other potential updates to keep in mind, um, I have thought about, I did bring this up in our last Let's Play of Pikmin, where I decided to, of course, um, do a live stream and start streaming out games that norm normally wouldn't be, I guess, ideal for Let's Plays, if that's the right way to put it. Um, I have been pushing that aside for a little bit later. I just needed to get some stuff ready. I uh, haven't gotten been, haven't been around, around to do that yet, but of course, um, part of of course doing it all on the YouTube channel has been the main goal, and I have decided on doing some things on um, for live streaming, whether it is on YouTube or another platform. Yet to decide on that yet, but of course we'll find out all that soon in the timing in the coming times, and that is the end. fitting end. We conquered Hoenn, we did it, and of course, what a great way to end it. And I did bring it up in the past episode that I won't be going any further than this, so in terms of like doing rematches of the Battle Frontier, haven't planned on doing that, so this is where the Pokemon Emerald journey ends, guys. I do apologize if you did want to see that or were looking forward to seeing that. Um, that is just not something I will be doing. If, it, if I may happen to come across it, I will do it, but in terms of what I plan on doing, isn't something I planned. So of course I do apologize on that, but of course I do give much appreciation and much love for those who have been tuning in and of course are following me in this journey. This has been your boy Ron. Thank you so much for watching Pokemon Emerald Let's Play. And until next time, I will see you guys in Let's Play number four. I will see you all next time. Take care.